We've been talking a lot about the custom of Jesus, about the culture of Jesus. I want to talk about another custom that was in place during his time that really is going to help us to understand why he does one thing, but he doesn't do another. Sometimes, if we don't know the full background, we find ourselves questioning, Jesus, why did you wait? Or why did you do it right away? And sometimes it doesn't really sit right with us because we don't know the culture. Well, today I want to talk about what was called a messianic miracle. A miracle the rabbi said that no man on earth could do unless he was the Messiah, unless he was God in the flesh. And we know that Jesus was the Messiah, and this is the miracle that I'm talking about. There was something called raising the dead after the fourth day. There was a tradition that that was in the time of Jesus. And I'm not saying that Jesus believed this, but the people of his time did, and that's important to note. The Jewish people believed that when a person died, that the spirit of the person would hover over the body for three days. And so if he came back on the day that person died, if you prayed, and if God enabled you, the spirit could re-enter the person and it could go away. If he came back on the second day, same thing could happen. On the third day, the same thing could happen. But the Mishnah teaches, which is Jewish ancient literature, it says that when the spirit came back on the fourth day, that the face would begin to show signs of decay. The spirit would no longer recognize the person and would leave for all of eternity. So this is the theology. This is the understanding. The resurrection is possible within the first three days, but on the fourth and beyond, impossible unless God himself shows up on the scene. If you remember, Jesus is, is in Jerusalem and he's ministering and he gets the news that his friend Lazarus is dying. And what does Jesus do? He does something that I thought was very insensitive. They said, your friend is dying. And he says, well, thank you very much, but I got stuff I got to do. And he doesn't go to his friend's aid. It doesn't make any sense. I remember when my dad was diagnosed with a brain tumor and he was dying and the doctor said he's not going to make it through the weekend. You know what? I didn't say thank you for the news. I stayed there. I, I canceled everything that was going on in my life. Nothing in that moment mattered more than being there with my dad. But yet Jesus, when he gets the news of his dear friend, he chooses to wait. But then when you don't understand the background, you don't know why, but it says when he went, as in John 11:7, 7, on his arrival, Jesus found that Lazarus had already been in the tomb how many days? Four days. Because he knew if he showed up on that day, that was the day people believed only the Messiah could raise the dead. And so Jesus wasn't late. He was right on time. And so friends, no matter what situation you find yourself in, when people say it's too late, it's not. God's not late. Pray, believe. He is the fourth day Messiah and he will come through for you.